An absolutely massive info leaked drop for Halo Infinite. Talking about many specific details that you're gonna wanna know about Halo Infinite. So stay tuned throughout the whole video to understand all the details. How's it going everybody? Kevin here once again, give you another news information on video when it comes to Halo, specifically Halo Infinite and leaked information. If you enjoyed these news informational videos, please make sure to tap that like button as it greatly helped out the video and channel. So let's get right into the topics here. So recently there was a link that was being shared around. I can't share detailed, but I can put a link in the description if you want to talk about it guys. It goes into details about Halo Infinite and some crucially leaked information that I think everyone should get to know about this. Story details, new vehicles and weapons along with emotes going into Halo Infinite. So let's get right into the details here. Now bringing attributes into Halo Infinite could be rather interesting. I wouldn't think about that but it could be kind of cool in a way to customize your experience while playing the campaign because it is looking to be possibly an open world kind of experience so I would totally expect to see something like that happen to give it a little more depth and more replayability when it comes to playing Halo's campaign. Talking about the campaign, we do have some story details as well. We all know that Halo 5 left much to be desired when it comes to storytelling in Halo. Now, we don't know any exact story details yet, but we do know a few characters' actors involved in the game. Infinite looks to be bringing back some familiar characters like Miranda Keys, Sergeant Johnson, and even 343 Guilty Spark. With Infinite being a so-called soft reboot, this would make sense as Call of Duty Modern Warfare did something very similar. Though there will be a whole new cast of star-studded voice actors to accompany the Chief. Blue Team is being completely recasted, Kelly being portrayed by Kristen Stewart of Twilight fame, Fred being played by Chris Brown, the pop artist, and lastly, Linda is going to be voiced by Kim Kardashian, which, yes, you know, that does seem like a big stretch, but, you know, she does have prior voice acting experience with the TV show American Dad. This is my husband, Stan. Oh my god, you have such a beautiful home. Again, some of these may be a little concerning as these guys are not exactly real well known for their acting. Uh, Chris and Stewart kind of, you know, criticized for being rather lifeless in her acting ability. Chris Brown, well, he's a singer, not necessarily an actor and kind of not really relevant at the moment but i guess the guy's looking for work right and especially the big one kim kardashian that's the biggest worry right there though she does have experience with some voice acting so maybe it could be just fine now we do know that microtransactions are going to be in halo infinite as it's going to be a game as a service meaning there will probably be some form of a season pass or microtransaction system to help maintain the game as they're looking to have this game as a platform as they've mentioned so they got to have a continuous source of revenue coming in for the game and looks like they have a little more details brought down broken down into this topic now we know that microtransactions will be in halo infinite and it seems like Microsoft is looking to capitalize on the trend of having emotes. Games like Destiny 2, Call of Duty, and Fortnite have popularized the monetization of emotes, and Halo Infinite is rumored to have similar emotes like Dab, Moonwalk, Floss, and the Turk Dance will be in this game. These emotes look to add a new level and fun to the game that I cannot wait to experience. Dab on them haters, Chief. Now this portion, I think I need a little help talking about this next section, so take it away. We all have to address one of the more recent leaks of a UNSC boat in Halo Infinite. Now I recently heard from some insider information that this UNSC watercraft is not just for wartime usage, but doubles as Master Chief's luxury suite. Fully decked out with his and her sinks, beds, and a gym for Chiefy to stay nice and beefy. Chief being such an important member of the UNSC, saving the world multiple times, he deserves a bit of pampering every once in a while. Of course, an important part of a shooter game like Halo are the weapons, and Halo Infinite looks to not disappoint. With Super Fiesta, consistently being one of, if not the most played modes in Halo 5, 343 doubled down on expanding the power of the wreck weapons. The Nornfane looks to return, which does seem consistent with the cover of the new Halo book, Shadows of Reach. 343 will be upping the ante when it comes to wreck weapons featuring a Half-Life-like gravity gun to pick up a Spartan and slam them to the ground. A new weapon to come, currently referred to as the BFHG, the big f***ing Halo gun, where it shoots the UNSC frigate Mac rounds that will act as a Modern Warfare 2 tactical nuke and will kill the everyone on the map and end the game. 
absolutely insane. Lastly, we have a leak on the music for Halo Infinite. Music has always been a crucial part of the Halo experience, and Infinite looks to deliver with a star-studded lineup of musicians. Steve Vai back on guitar to give you the crunchy shred tones like he did back in Halo 2. We also have new artists to make the soundtrack more mainstream. Billie Eilish is set to replace the classic Gregorian chants of the main Halo theme with her signature melodramatic style, as well as Cardi B to bring a club thumping spectacle that would even get the profits out of their chair. So those are some of the insider leaks when it comes to Halo Infinite. What do you guys believe of this? Obviously it is a leak, so we can't take it for truth, but also we gotta make sure that, you know, we do take on this information what we can, because sometimes these things do come true. So if you guys like these kind of news and informational videos, these leaks and stuff like that, make sure to tap that like button, it greatly helps out the video and channel. So make sure to check out the links down below to everyone that was in this video, and happy April Fool's Day. Yeah, 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 yeah.